Election night is in full swing. Polls are about to be open for another hour and a half. So we have crews at voting centers all across our area. And Becca Habegger is live in North Sacramento's Del Paso Heights community. And nearly 200 voters have cast a ballot in person there today. Becca, how's it going? Also, I love the red, white, and blue. I see what you did there. <laughs> Thanks, Alex. Leaning into the election night color palette here. Yeah, things are great. I'm at the Greater Sacramento Urban League here in the Del Paso Heights community. Here, I just asked seconds ago, literally seconds ago, how many voters they have seen at this point. They said 191 in person, and that doesn't include the many more people who have dropped off their mail-in ballot here as well. You know, all in the weeks leading up to the elections, ABC 10 has been out in the community engaging with voters and potential voters. We've asked whether their voting and which barriers might keep them from voting. And experts in voter access and engagement tell us in-person voting locations are especially important for historically marginalized communities and young voters. I spoke with Tamara Walton, a voter who lives just down the street. Earlier today, she brought her 18-year-old daughter to vote for the first time. And when Walton voted, she brought her five-year-old son with her. I asked her about the importance of bringing her kids to the polls. People of color don't normally feel like their voices are heard um, and I feel like we may not vote all the time so I just want them to show, you know, show them that it's important um, to vote and even if it doesn't go the way that we wanted it to, you know, just know that our, our opinion mattered and our vote counted. If you are in the Del Paso Heights community or the Hagenwood area, you can still come here to the Greater Sacramento Urban League at uh, you know the, the corner here. It's open till eight o'clock, and you can do same day registration. You can bring your mail in ballot, drop that off here. Uh, the polls are open till eight p.m., so still time to come vote. Alex, all right, Becca, I'm happy to see you have your I Vote sticker today, so we can be matching now. <laughs> yep. All right. Thanks, Becca.